Previously on Shannon Reads and Stuff and Things, Doki Doki Literature Club. A synonym for a marijuana cigarette. Um, moving on. So many nice, uh, so any nice gesture from you is just a pleasant surprise. Will make me happy no matter what. Is that so? Well, he is this disemboweled cat. <laughs> oh! I guess that works. And now, some new shit. Meanwhile, Natsuki is rummaging around in the closet. Ugh! Oh my god, no! I hear Natsuki utter an exasperated sigh from within the closet. Yeah, right inside of it, because you could shove her ass in there. She's so tiny. She seems to be annoyed by something. I approach her in case she needs a hand. What up, girl pal? Gal pal? Girlfriend? I'm seriously gonna pick up the fucking soundtrack for this game. I shouldn't like it as much as I do, but I really do like it. You looking for something in there? Frickin' Bonica. That bitch. She never puts my stuff back in the right spot. What's the point in keeping your collection organized if someone else is just gonna mess it up? Natsuki slides a bunch of stacked books and boxes across the shelf. Manga. You read manga, right? Um, no. I mean, sometimes. Manga's one of those things where you can't admit you're really into it until you figure out where the other person stands. I could see that. I could see that. I only feel really comfortable talking about all the shit that I like because I know that if people are watching my fucking videos, one of two things. Either they're gonna hate me just because I'm me, or they're gonna really like the things that I'm into. Those are the only two real options here, so I'm... I'm taking the fucking gamble anyway with every word that comes out of my mouth. I might as well just say everything. I like... Fucking fat chicks. I mean... <laughs> I mean, okay, I'm one. that's kind of an incorrect statement. And two, I took, because, okay, because it's a joke, because I'm not serious about it. I was originally going to say, I like fucking cats, or like dogs, or like something really fucking horrible. Please don't cut that out and cut it and put it into something terrible. Please. Context is everything. Um... Uh, I might have cut that part out of the video. I was trying to make a joke. It wasn't worth it. It wasn't good. <laughs> Dear everyone who just joined the I fucking hate that guy side of the thing. Uh, told you it was going to happen. Oh, Natsuki, please change the subject. <laughs> How did you know, anyway? I heard you bring it up at some point, like literally yesterday. Are you retarded? Besides, it's kind of written on your face, like, you are a total fucking loser. <laughs> what the hell is that supposed to mean? I... I see. There's a lone volume of manga and it's a stack of various books on the side of one of the shelves. Curious, I pull it out of the stack. There it is! The Great Golden Book! Um, Natsuki snatches it out of my hand. She then turns to a box of manga and slips the volume right into the middle of the rest. Ah, much better organization as it fucking should be. Single box set with only one book missing is probably the most irritating sight in the world. You know what's the most fucking irritating sight in the world? Going to a fucking bookstore and looking up the manga or the light novel section and only finding like the third or fourth fucking issue in the thing because everyone already takes the fucking first or second, which I know was what I was already going to do. So I'm part of the fucking problem. But you know what? It pisses me off, because I like, I want to try some new shit, but I can't, I'm too scared to, j I, I don't, I just, I, just give me the fucking first issue, give me something. Give me something that makes sense. Okay, um, moving on. I know that feel. Yeah, also, I never saved earlier, I'm gonna save now. Maybe? Oh, look at this, save right there, oh, it's Tuesday, November 28th, 2017, at 3.05 a.m. Neat. Okay. Oh shit, I just broke the fourth wall. You know now. This is when it was done. I know how I feel. I get a closer look at the box she's admiring. Parfait girls? 
It's a series I've never heard of in my entire life. Yep, it's about a bunch of girls who like getting down and dirty with the desserts. Yeah, eclairs in the act. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> that probably means it's either way out of my demographic or it's simply terrible. If you're gonna judge, you could do it through the glass on that door. That's right, bitch. Mm. You're fighting words that are on your face that are not words, but they're your face. She points to the classroom door. H -h hey, I wasn't judging. You were absolutely fucking judging right there. I didn't even say anything. It was the tone of your voice. I see it in your, I can see it in your eyes. I can see it in your smile. Ugh. Um, well, I'll tell you one thing, Shannon. Consider this a lesson straight from the literature club. Don't judge a book by its cover. All right, this motherfucker thinks he's really clever with him. <laughs> Shout out to the writer, I like it. In fact, I kill cats on the weekend. This is all these fucking terrible cat jokes is for you fucking freaking out on me the other day, Betty. I'm so glad that didn't come through in the fucking video. That was so loud and annoying and obnoxious the entire fucking time. Oh, thank God. Um, Natsuki pulls out the first volume of our Fae Girls in the box, and I'm gonna show you exactly why. She shoves the book right into my hands. Yep. Oh. I stare at the cover. It features four girls in colorful attire star striking in us the most striking animated feminine poses. It's exceedingly moe. Don't just no, don't just stand there. You you fucking idiot. <laughs> I hate what <laughs> Keep jumping to fucking meowth. <laughs> Natsuki grabs my arm and pulls me out of the closet. How could you pull me in that closet? We shut the door and then just Tell spooky ghost I actually don't do that. I'm scared of this game already. Don't you dare fucking tell me spooky ghost stories. She then takes a seat against the wall beneath the window sills. She pats on the ground next to her, signaling me to sit there. Again, Natsuki is totally my favorite. Look at her. She's the best. Again, she's probably a fucking nightmare considering this goddamn game, but uh, I choose to believe there is a future for me and her. Wouldn't chairs be more comfortable? I take my seat. Chairs, would it work? We can't read at the same time like that. I mean, we could. We'd literally just have to move a chair. Unless they're connected to the desk. Some chairs do that. But even then, we could just push two desks together. And then hold hands. Oh, what is that? I guess it's easier to be close together like this. <laughs> I choked him out spit. D don't just say that. It's, you make me feel weird about it. Natsuki crosses her arms and scooches an inch away from me, and then I scoot an inch closer. I'm sorry. I didn't exactly expect to be sitting with closed door either. Not that I can say it's a particular best thing. <laughs> best girl. Okay. Uh, I hope. <laughs> See, the thing is, is because I'm I'm fully expecting someone who's seen this game to be watching this video now, and they're being like, "Oh, he's fucked." <laughs> Just like you have no idea what's coming on on this fucking shit, dude. Uh, and I don't. And that's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it. Uh, I open the book. It's only a few seconds before Natsuki once again inches closer, reclaiming the additional space while she hops, hopes I wouldn't notice. Oh, I noticed. Bitch, I've been measuring that fucking distance between us. I can feel her peering over my shoulder, much more eager to begin reading than I am. Wow, how long has it been since I read from the beginning? Huh? You don't go back and flip through the older volumes every now and then? Uh, not really. Maybe it's sometimes after I've already finished the series. Uh, hey, are you paying attention? This is the best part. Um, I am, but nothing's really happened yet, so I can talk at the same time. It looks like it's about a bunch of friends in high school. Typical slice life affair. My kind of book. And, and show. I kind of grew out of these, since it's rare to be for the writing to be entertaining enough to make up for the lack of blood. How fucking dare you, good sir, you judgy prick. It's the best kind. Seriously though, I fucking love Slice of Life shit. I really can't stand action-heavy anime stuff. 
It's sad because I know I miss out on a touch it, like Attack on Titan and fucking I know not everyone will agree with it, but Sword Art Online and Fairy Tale and a million other fucking uh, action heavy bullshit series, which I hear are fucking great. And again, some people fucking hate them, but like uh, other people fucking love them and they're great and all this shit. And I just I can't doesn't doesn't fucking do anything for me. And I definitely can't deal with fucking bloody gory horrible anime shit. Unless it's Helsing, Helsing Ultimate Abridged, because um, that's funny enough for me to not give a fuck. Um, you know, the closest I can ever get to that is, like, Ruby. Other than that, it is, like, 100% Sly's Life for me, and I fucking love that shit. Give me recommendations. Um, so, what should I expect from this? Is there gonna be, like, plot? Like, titties? I mean, well, obviously, you think... Oh, I would enjoy something that didn't have a plot? I mean, well, I guess I know what you're saying. A lot of the beginning is about simple things. Like, there's this really funny chapter where they're obsessed with a guy at an ice cream shop. Uh, but that just helps you get to know the characters. Uh, besides, it's still entertaining. Uh, but later on, there's all kinds of trauma. Like, they all get into their backstories, and when some of their romance starts to happen, that's really what makes it so good. Again, I feel like they're the, the, the they're fucking laying this shit on like, yeah, no, shit's about to get something eventually. You just gotta wait for it. Also, but that's how the, all, the, all the best stories go. See, that's that's how it goes. You lure them in with falling in love with these characters through joyful, fun, happy moments, and then you fucking tear their lives apart. And it makes it hurt so much worse. I just talked about Ruby. Ruby is another great example. Fucking, uh, the first two volumes are chill and fun, kind of just action, funny and shit. And then volume three happens, you're like, holy fucking shit. Why would you do that to my heart? And you're just like, it's that kind of thing. Is If you didn't have that buildup, you wouldn't care as much. That's the thing. I know there's a million fucking examples. It's just that I just brought up Ruby and it's also my favorite fucking series. Well, fuck, so fuck you if you're judging me. It's good, watch it. This really makes it so good. There are so many touching parts. Like when they touch parts. <laughs> See what I did there? I'm clever. Oh, does that sound? It sounds like you really know what you're talking about. Maybe I underestimated you. Another series that I hear does that sort of thing is like Madoka Magic. I still have never seen it. That is one series that I actually really do want to check out but haven't checked out yet because just haven't had the time or money. But I would very much like to check it out here at some point. I've heard nothing but good things. And sad things, but good things. Um, maybe I underestimated you. <laughs> yes, my mortal end. <laughs> I don't know what that, yeah, that was. Hey, wait. What's that supposed to mean? What? Natsuki giving me a little shove. <laughs> you can't push me away, girl. <laughs> I just meant that I haven't seen you yet at your full power. Hmm. A save. Uh, this chapter seems like it's about baking. This is just a guess, but is there a lot of baking in this manga? Well... Natsuki pauses for a moment as if she doesn't want to admit something. Yes. Dude, you say that like that's a bad thing. Some like really good shows are about cooking. Another show I've never seen. Food Wars. I've heard nothing about good things about that. That whole fucking show is about food. I think. <laughs> or if you know that, I'm just guessing based on the title and things that I've seen about it. And why the hell does that matter? Yeah, I mean, it doesn't. I was just curious. Since, I mean, you enjoy baking too, right? That's... Oh my god, it's just a coincidence. I just happened to get into begging around the same time I got this manga. Like, I would never get into anything because it's a manga. I feel bad for anyone that impressionable. <laughs> so I probably should tell you about this manga about where these two high school students fuck. <laughs> uh. <laughs> It's fucking gross, but it's kind of cute and adorable. It's not you when I do it, I'm just, I imagine it as, okay. <laughs> Definitely not a coincidence. I guess that explains Natsuki's interest in baking. 
Still, of all the hobbies to pick up from a manga, that's definitely one of the better ones. Not to mention she's really good at it, so who am I to judge? Oh my god. Can I? Oh, I can. Oh my goodness, look at her, she's so cute. Excuse me while I just digitally etch this image into my fucking brain. We read on for a few more minutes. I finished a couple of chapters at this point. Seriously, fuck the other three. She's definitely the best so far. Are you sure this isn't boring for you? It's not. No, you're just watching me read? Well, I'm, I'm fine with that. Just being close to you. Hold me at your arms. Uh, if you say so. I mean, to the other thing. Uh, I guess it's fun sharing something you like with someone else. I always get excited when I convince any of my friends to pick up a series I enjoy. Also, shout out to the art in this game, because again, this is a free fucking game. But this, is, this seems really well put together. I actually really like this. It's shout outs to the people who did the art, and uh, so far with the writing and all that, I'm, I'm a huge fan of this. This is a game I would have expected to be like $15. I don't know how long it is, but I, I would have paid that kind of money for it. Um, if I had money, I don't have fucking money. Maybe I'll get that special, because they have like a special edition that has like the soundtrack and all that shit. So maybe I'll, I'll pick that up. Support them, support you know? Support the shit that you like. That's why I always like buying all the physical media, media that I have. I, have all, I love collecting physical shit because I, it, it feels more like I'm actually supporting someone instead of just like, I don't know. It just feels better that way. You know what I mean? Uh. Hmm? Y you don't? Um. Oh my god. I love it. This is not. Well, I, w I wouldn't really know. What do you mean? Don't you share your manga with any of your friends? <laughs> I'm gonna do that anytime the name changes. Could you not rub it in? But do rub something, just not that. Jeez. Oh, um, I'm sorry. <laughs> like, who could ever get any of my friends to read this? I just think bug is for kids. Bastards. I kind of bring it up with them being all like, Oh, you still haven't grown out of that yet? Mix them up. Punch him in the faith. Give him, give him good old one too. Ah, oh, I know those kinds of people. Fuck them, right? But not really, because that would be too nice. Honestly, it takes a lot of effort to find friends who don't judge. Much less friends who are also into it. Dude, you have no idea how fucking right you are. I'm already kind of a loser, so I guess I kind of just gravitated, gravitated to the other losers over time. Yeah, but it's probably harder for someone like you. Huh? Thank you. Yeah, that's pretty accurate. Wait, which part? I mean, I can't. I feel like I can't even keep it in my own room. I don't even know what my dad would do if he found this. Please don't let that be a horrible thing that happens towards the end of this fucking game. I don't. My heart is scared now. Um, it probably doesn't even need to be, but like, I just again the. I'm constantly afraid that something horrible is going to happen at this game at every moment. I just, I don't, I don't like that. <laughs> That's the scariest part of this fucking game, is I'm constantly expecting some horrible shit to happen. Um, at least it's safe here in the club, in the club room. Yeah. Oh my god, look at me, I'm so, I'm so angry. Baka. Uh, so Monica is kind of a jerk about it. Oh, I just can't wait, can I? I mean, it paid off in the end, didn't it? I mean, here I am, reading it. Let's not like that solves any of my problems. Maybe. But at least you're enjoying yourself, right? Uh, 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 <clears throat> so? <laughs> Jeez, that's enough. Are you gonna keep reading or what? Uh, yeah, yeah, no, I'm, I'm in it to win it. I flip the page. Suddenly, Natsuki starts laughing. <laughs> I totally forgot that this happens. Let's see, he puts her finger on one of the panels. Midori is my favorite character. You always feel a little bad for her since she's so unlucky, but it gets especially bad when... Uh, 
I shouldn't be talking about that yet. Just finish this chapter. That's the worst, because you always know some shit's gonna happen, and you can't ever tell anyone about it, because you're like, I'll spoil it, but I ain't wanna spoil it, but I don't wanna. Don't spoil shit, people. It's not cool. Natsuki's voice sparkles with excitement. It's a stark contrast to her usual bossy tone. But if she's not used to sharing her favorite manga with her friends, I can understand why. Oh, I need water. It's hard to express in words the feeling you get when connecting with someone like that. And being able to provide that to Natsuki, for whom it's a rare experience, the thought makes me smile a little bit to myself. Sir, do you know that your name is a, 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 a synonym for a marijuana cigarette? Um, moving on. So many nice, uh, so any nice gesture from you is just a pleasant surprise. It'll make me happy no matter what. Is that so? Well, he is this disemboweled cat. <laughs> oh! I guess that works. Excuse me while I just digitally etch this image into my fucking brain.